Yo! Thanks! You know what? Mamaya na tayo mag intro Panoorin na lang agad natin itong malupit na montage na ginawa namin para sa product na to. So, let's go! So let me introduce myself, Dirk Spencer of Magic Means Vape Lounge. Today, sumahan nyo kami para i-review itong product na to from uh, VapeX. Ito ang Meteor. Alright so guys, so pinadalan tayo ni VapeX or VapeX ng uh, kanilang latest product which is the Meteor. And kasama dito is yung kanilang charging base kung saan uh, mamaya titingnan natin. So what's in the box muna tayo? Tingnan natin kung ano nasa loob ng mga box na to. Let's go! Alright, so now, what's in the box naman tayo? So, tingnan natin kung ano nasa loob nito, okay? Alright. Alright, so uh, there you have it. Uh, inside the box is the mod itself. So, tingnan natin. Alright, so ito yung uh, VapX or VapX or VapX, I don't know. VapX Meteor. Ayan. Ito, ang unang laman. Alright, so tingnan pa natin kung ano nasa loob. So, uh, inside the box is, of course, another box. Ito lang. Ayan. So, uh, well, inside the box or the second box is yon Type-C charging cable. Ayan. So, ito yung kasama pa sa loob ng box. And, and check pa natin. Wala na. Wala na siyang kasama kung hindi yung pinaka-unit itself, which is the VapX Meteor and uh, Type-C charging cable. I mean, that's it. Yeah, so basically that's it ang ating what's in the box uh, which is very short for this video. I mean, uh, so pag-uusapin pa natin siya mamaya, okay? So uh, kung bakit yun lang yung laman niya. Alright, so next box is yung kaniyang uh, charging base. So tingnan natin kung ano nasa loob dito. There you go. Ang ating pinaka-charging uh, base or the charging base itself, okay? And then inside the box is... Wala na din, okay? So basically... Uh, ang laman kanina nung uh, VapX, the unit, is uh, the VapX and then the charging cable. So now, is the charging base lang. So mamaya pag-uusapan natin why. Alright, so there you have it guys, ang ating what's in the box. So sa next part, let's take a closer look dito sa ating VapX Meteor. Let's go! Alright, so now we're back and let's take a closer look para dito sa ating latest product ng VapX which is the Meteor. 510. Alright, so guys, pag-usapan natin yung kanyang mga specs. Alright, so first, uh, ito yung kanyang LCD display. Down here is yung kanyang plus and minus button. Pag-usapan natin yung kanyang side. So, makikita mo here on top is yung kanyang firing button. Sa gitna, may makikita ka parang arrow na design. And then, pagbaba mo dito, nandito yung kanyang charging port. Yan. So, type C charging port. Alright, sa kabilang side is makikita mo yung kanyang brand name which is the VapX. Alright, sa pinakalikod naman so makikita mo naman dito. So this one is leather with red stitching and then nakasulat dito yung kanyang pangalan which is the Meteor. Okay, pag-usapan naman natin to. So around here is a metal plate kung saan ito yung magnet para dun sa ating charging base. So sa gitna meron dito apat na circle kung saan dito yung ating contacts for our charging base. So this part is for the charging base. Then, on top of it is of course our 510. And yan, syempre yung kanyang contacts. And then, I forgot to mention, dito po, at saka dito, meron siyang mga butas kung saan, dun yung ating battery venting. So, yung hingahan para kung mag-init man tong mod na to. So, makakahinga pa rin yung mod natin. Okay? So, there you have it. Our take a closer look para dito sa ating VapX Meteor 510. Alright, so syempre, pag-usapan natin, syempre yung kanyang charging base. Ayan, so ito yung design ng kanyang charging base. And so square lang. So as you can see here in the middle, ito yung apat niyang contacts para dito sa ilalim ng ating VapX. Okay, so ipakita ko muna sa inyo how it looks like pag nakalagay na yung ating unit. Okay? So that's it. So makikita mo matibay naman yung magnet nga. Hindi agad siya basta-basta natutumba or malalaglag. And then here, meron siyang apat na mga butas dito. I don't know is for the design or maybe for the battery venting also or parang hingahan. Kasi again, this uh, charging port is fast 
charging guys. So this one is fast charging. So syempre magiinit din siya, 'di ba, yung mga charger natin. Pag matagal nang nakasaksak yung ating phones, nagiiinit yung ating mga charger. So I'm sure na nilagyan nila 'to ng butas not for the design only and also for the battery venting or para makahinga yung kaniyang uh, init or para makalabas yung init na yun, okay? So uh, venting para lumabas yung init, okay? And then here sa likod is yung kanyang Type-C charging port. So, dito mo na sasaksak yung inyong charger. So, guys, so if you have uh, Android phone, so if you're using a 45 watts na charger, solid na solid yun. Match na match yun dito kasi the advice na gumamit daw tayo ng 45 watts na charger para daw uh, mas mapabilis palalo yung kanyang super fast charging. So, I think up to, up to 10 minutes or 12 minutes. I'm not sure kasi wala akong, ano, wala akong 45 watts. Pero nakita ko dun sa ano nila, review nila sa IG and Facebook Facebook na yun nga daw, super fast charging. I mean, we need to try it. Okay? And then down here is yung kanyang logo. And then it says here VAPX. And then nakalagay dito is yung kanyang input, output voltage, output current, and last is made in China. There you have it. So that's it. Nothing much. And then I forgot to mention meron pala siya dito apat na rubber. And so para glass yung table mo so it will sit on place para hindi siya dumulas. So okay na okay yun. Okay? So there you have it guys. Our take a closer look para dito sa ating VAPX. X Meteor. So sa next video, pag-usapan naman natin yung kanyang mga pros and cons. Alright, so now we're back and pag-usapan naman natin ang kanilang mga pros and cons. Alright, so pag-usapan muna natin, syempre yung kanyang cons. So number one is yung kanyang user manual and etc. etc. Or yung kanyang paperwork na palagi kong sinasabi na, I mean, walang kwenta. <laughs> Hindi mo walang kwenta. I mean, na hindi naman natin kailangan pero now hinahanap-hanap ko kasi I don't know what the specs of this you know so somehow hinanap ko but anyway so yun wala akong nakitang user manual so sa VAPX siguro sinad nila so sa mga tao na gumagawa ng mga reviews and videos para sa kanila siguro to or maybe is this one is a special package or packaging so this one is not the retail package yet so they sent me this about a few weeks ago and then I've been trying this for almost uh, two weeks na or a week na they send this product just to test muna so that's why it's not a complete package I'm not sure okay so let's wait until they release their Meteor siguro kasama na dun lahat yung the user manual and etc etc okay so yun lang ang napansin ko dito sa unboxing ko so which is not a big deal okay so abangan natin VAPEX so ngayon pupunta naman tayo sa kanyang mga pro so there's so many things to talk about actually. So, nilista ko siya. So, number one is yung kanyang design. So, syempre, makikita mo yung kanyang design. Super slick design man. I mean, to be honest, na starstruck ako sa ganda ng design niya. I mean, uh, guys, we've seen a lot of uh, mods, uh, vape, yeah, sobrang daming mga mapuporma, maangas But this one, so far, is my favorite I mean, nakita nyo naman kanina sa montage Doon sa closer look natin Super ganda, super porma Wala akong masasabi so, sa design And sa porma niya, 10-10 Yeah Number 2 is yung kanyang display Ayan, so what I liked about the display Is, ano, napaka-vibrant ng color niya I mean, ang sarap lang tingnan I mean, pag tinignan mo siya, is kitang-kita mo Tapos lalabas yung logo sa unahan. And then as you can see, I mean super clear. Diba? So super liwanag niya and then napakadaling basahin. So importante sa akin yun. Kasi para pag na-check ko kung anong mga reading ko, etc. So it's easy to see. So yeah, number two sa akin is yung kanyang display. Number three is yung kanyang firing button. And so yung self-firing button, parang naano ako, parang natuwa ako. Kasi super lambot niyang pindutin. Pag nagpa-fire ka, it's like, it's like a toy na pinipindot mo. Na, I mean, super lambot na may tension siya na matigas to lalambot. So super sarap niyang pindutin. Goods the goods yun para sa akin. Okay? Number four, this product is uh, powered by Type-C charging cable. Well, syempre, uh, nabagit ko kanina is this one is super fast charging. Pinasak mo dito yung Type-C charging cable mo, I mean, super bilis. Okay? So, pag ang gamit mo pa lalo is yung malaking power brick, lalong mas mabilis. And then, pag ginamit mo yung kanyang charging dock, di ba, nakalagay dito kanina is super fast charging. Type-C, super duper bilis mag-charge. So, goods na goods yun, di ba? Okay, last but not the least, ito product na to, IP68 rated. So, it means this product is uh, waterproof, dustproof, and uh, shockproof, which is 
super goods na goods. Why? I-break down natin. Waterproof, guys. So, ngayon, uh, syempre, pag may dala kang vape product, nasa inuman ka or nasa party ka, I mean, hindi mo may iwasan na sometimes nakababa yung vape mo and suddenly mababasa kasi basa yung lamesa or if you're eating or if you're drinking something, pwede pwedeng mabasa yung mod mo. So, masisira yung vape mo. I mean, having a product na waterproof is goods the goods. Diba? Ayos na yung sunod. So, pag nabasa, goods pa din. Sunod is dust proof. So, syempre, uh, pag hindi mo siya ginagamit, nandun lang nakastock sa bahay mo or nakadisplay sa kung saan-saan. So, kahit madumihan yung dyan is hindi naman niya masisira or mapapasok ng kung ano-ano. So, goods yun. Last is shockproof, which is gustong gusto ko. Why? Kasi sometimes I'm very clumsy kung saan uh, pinapato ko na lang kung saan-saan yung uh, vape ko or pod kasi I have a messy table. So, sometimes nadadali ko siya, bumabagsa. Yun. Kalimitan na sisira agad yung, yung vape ko or pod. So, this one is bagay na bagay sa atin. So, kahit mabagsak ko, kahit ibalibang ko, kasi hindi siya masisira basta-basta. I saw a video. I mean, his name is uh, Clarito Abay. I mean, I was surprised. Wala pa akong VAPX nun. I saw a video of him. Una, nung dumating sa kanya yung product, eh, sabi niya, na test natin. So, binagsak niya yung product. I was like, surprised na nilaglag niya without any hesitation. So, binagsak niya. Boom. Yun, super ice na ice yun. Ay, yung ginawa niya. Uh, tinatawag niya itong series na to is parang torture test level 1. So, kung saan binagsak niya. Which is crazy. Which is super, like, awesome. You know? Like, ganun talaga yung pag-testing. Diba? Ganun talaga. Gusto mo talaga i-test ko yung kanyang durability. And then, yung kanyang torture level number 2. Kung saan, pumunta siya sa kanin, kanyang lababo. Kumuha siya ng tabo. Binu uh, binuksan niya yung sink. And then, nilublub niya to. And then, sabi niya, okay, so, palta natin ng, uh, ng wattage. So, buhay yung unit. Habang tinetest niya, habang nilulubog niya dun sa tabo, ang ginagamit ganun niya pa. I mean, again, that's how you test this product or yung pagka-waterproof niya. Okay, solid na solid. Then, he made another video kung saan parang uh, inipit niya pa sa sasakyan para just to test the durability of this product. And then, meron din siyang video na ginawa na parang, I don't know, parang pinawar zo or parang ganun. Super credits to you, Sir Clarito Abay, for making those torture video, which is talagang mind-blowing. Super talagang na nalaman namin na this product is super duper tibay. So, thanks to you, Sir. Ah, Siyempre, may downside din yun. Siyempre, pag nilaglag mo, magkakameron siya ng dent, magkakameron siya ng gas -gas. So, syempre, we need to take care of our vape or mods na ganito o ganita. So, ingatan natin. So, para hindi natin magasgasin yung ating baby. So, there you have it, guys. Ang ating uh, pros and cons para dito sa Uh, product na to, which is the Meteor VapX 510. So, pag-usapan naman natin, syempre, yung kanyang charging base. Ito, ang nakikita ko dito, lahat pros eh. Wala naman tong cons. Kasi, alam mo kung bakit? Kasi, this charging base is mind-blowing. So, pag nilagay mo yung kanyang, uh, for example, nilagay mo yung kanyang charger, like the normal Type-C cable, doon papunta sa power brick, you're charging it in the inside the body. I mean, mabilis na siya eh. Mabilis na mag-charge. I mean, for a standard vape, super bilis. Pero, pag ginamit mo itong charging base at dinak mo dito, man, ang sasabihin dito sa LCD, fast charging. Dinodoble nito yung speed. And my most favorite part, para dito sa charging base na to, kung saan ipapatang mo lang siya dyan, and then nahipak ka, and then after using it, I mean, just simply put it there. Hindi ka tulad nung ibang vape na ipapatang mo sa lamesa mo na pwedeng magasgasan, pwedeng matabig, when you're working on your table, doing something, I mean, i-plug mo dun, then it's a charge, or kung gusto mong hipak, I mean, you can hipak anytime, and then put it dyan again. Hipak, and then trabaho, or do something, or maybe watching. You know, meron kang side table, put it there. So again, napaka all one ng buhay mo kung meron kang charging base. If you're gonna buy this product, consider getting one of this. Kasi, I mean, super worth it, charging base. Performance check. Ayan, so performance check muna tayo ng ating VAPX Meteor. On top of our Meteor, yung ating Hellbeast by Hellvape. Napaka solid na atomizer. Alien War, 28 gauge, 6 loops. And so, coil expert. So now, we're gonna try it. We're gonna vape on it. And syempre, yung juice natin gagamitin. Flavory, this is Black Oran. Ayan, so yung menthol. I love this one. So again, to open, 5 clicks. So we're set into 60 watts. So, let's vape on it. Cloud check. So, lead, no? Ah, uh, yun. So, hindi natin sasabihin yung ano, yung uh, kung okay ba yun. Kasi, solid na solid yung ano natin, eh. Yung atomizer. So, I mean, you should try it yourself. And then, I'm gonna make another review special for this atomizer. Okay? So, for the performance of our VAPX Meteor 510, I mean, uh, super ganda. I mean, sobrang 
Ah, uh, ang bilis ng contacts niya. I mean, pag pinair mo, nagpa-fur talaga agad. Solid na solid, okay? This product is not that heavy, not that big. Saktong-sakto lang sa kamay ko. So that's it, guys. Ang aking performance check para dito sa ating VAPX Meteor 510. Alright, guys. Umabot ka sa dulo. Swerte mo. Kasi bakit? I mean, hindi ko in-announce yung ating surprise giveaway para dito sa video na to. Yes, especially for this video. So you're very lucky kasi umapot ka hanggang sa dulo. So guys, mayroon akong surprise sa inyo. Yes, magigiveaway na tayo. Finally, uh, VAPX is very kind. So binigyan tayo ng sombrero. Ha? Huh? Sombrero lang yung binigay? Para iparapol? No, guys! This one is for the second place. Siyempre, dalawang pinadala. Isa para sa akin. So, susuotin ko na. Dalawa ang mananalo. Bakit dalawa? Kasi, pinadalhan din tayo ng isa pang meteor. So, siyempre, isa para sa akin and isa din para sa inyo. Yun nga lang, hindi kasama yung charging base kasi this one, they sent to me to try it. So, it's mine. So, guys, paano sumali? Okay, ngayon, kung napapanood mo na tong video na to, pumunta ka na agad sa aking Facebook page. Hanapin mo lang ang Dirks Perez Official. Alright, just type in Dirk Perez Official na the moment na pinost ko to, nakapin na rin dun sa harapan kung paano sumali dito sa giveaway na to. So again guys, for this giveaway nandoon sa aking Facebook page lahat ng kompletong details. So ano pang inatay nyo? Hanapin nyo na Dirk Perez Official. So thank you and good luck! Alright, so there you have it guys, my quick review and unboxing para dito sa ating latest product ng VapeX which is the Meteor 510 including the charging base. Alright, so guys, uh, maraming maraming salamat uh, VapeX for sending me this over para matry natin at mapakita natin sa mga viewers natin kung gano'ng katibay at kung gano'ng kasolid yung inyong latest product. Nga pala! Nandito ko na naman sa dulo ng aking video Please do me a favor Kung hindi ka ba nakasubscribe I mean, please hit that subscribe button Mag-subscribe ka na And pindutin mo na rin yung notification bell Para updated ka sa mga latest product Katulad ito So if you like this video Please give me a thumbs up So once again Dirk Spanis here Of Magic Means Vape Lounge Until to the next video Thank you